Hello everyone, hope you are doing well and I believe the Lord has done great and mighty things in your life in this 2022. I want to speak about something that is a little bit controversial to some people, uh, but if you give me some time you will understand it more. I was thinking about it and said, let me record this for you, specifically for you, more so those that are still single. Um... What about if I tell you to accept in all situations that you may only sleep? <laughs> this sounds funny. I'm telling you to accept to sleep. When I talk about sleep, you know when someone speaks about sleep, it is there is some image that we get. But uh, when you try to look for the, the meaning of it, uh, sleep may be the state of rest. The state of rest. And when a person is in this time or the state of rest, uh, we are told that someone is half dead. Half dead meaning that your senses are not working at that time. You're not thinking at any, about anything. It's as if you are not around. You, you are away completely. Now, I come to, to realize that this is a state of rest that will help you in many, many challenges. We look at Jesus Christ. He slept. Some version says that he rested. Even in the midst of the storm, he decided to rest. He had that inner peace. Now, if I tell you to accept to sleep, I'm telling you to accept to rest no matter what is coming your way, no matter what is coming in your, in your life. Hallelujah. So, you should decide to rest. In all challenges, decide to rest. Accept to sleep and let God do His will. Actually, when I come to the single, I will tell you, accept to sleep and let God search for you. The right word would be, I'm not single and searching, but I'm single and God is searching for me. You know why? Have you ever asked yourself uh, why God made Adam to, to rest, to sleep? In Genesis chapter 2 verse 21, the Bible says, So God caused Adam a deep sleep and fell upon uh, the man, and he slept. Then he took one of his ribs and closed up to the flesh and, and at that place. Then the Lord fashioned into a woman the rib which he had gotten from the man. It's because many people are still single because they've got many, many, many different principles that they want to find in someone, even some of them that they cannot also themselves do. But he wants to meet this person when he has got this, when he has got that, when he has got this. The Bible says that God made Adam to sleep. At that time, God wanted to fashion something that is more best for Adam. Not anything, because if Adam was awake, maybe he would have begun saying, no, I don't like that nose, I don't like that hand, I don't like that height, I don't like that color, I don't like this, that and that. So God said, let me make for him someone that is right for him. And guess what? The Bible does not tell us to make a person that we are going to, to marry or to be with. The Bible tells us to see, to find you see? So you find someone that the Lord has made. You see, that's why when Adam woke up, when you go down and read 23, when Adam woke up, he began to appreciate what the Lord has done. He said, this is the flesh of my flesh, the bone of my bone. He saw. So the Bible calls a man to see. But in that time of seeing, you have to be at the state of rest, at the state of sleeping, at the state of rest when you don't have any any anything that you're putting in your mind only god the only principle that you would be having in your mind is god alone take a moment of rest take a moment of rest in whatever that is perturbing you take a moment of sleep i know challenges may be hard maybe much much things have happened in 2021 and you feel like you can't do it again take a moment of sleep when you are more depressed and stressed when you you need some time to sleep to rest father i pray for the person that is watching me right now that you will give them peace the peace of your salvation 
that peace that Jesus Christ said that I am going but I leave you with my peace. That is the peace that I'm, I'm requesting that you may bring unto anybody that is watching this video. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. God bless you. I remain Daniel. Keep following us on YouTube. Mwangus Daniel. Keep following us on Facebook. Grace for Service. On TikTok. Mwangus Daniel. On every social network or social media handle, we are using it to praise the name of the Lord. I love you so much. Bye-bye.